time at exactly 11 o'clock so we can set up everything so we can be able to be on time. Amen. Amen. And I want to say thank you to the leadership department because our time is then flowing as planned. Amen. And we pray to God that it stay the same. Amen. Amen. A very important announcement here before I continue with our regular announcement. Uh, on the 14th of this month, which is next Sunday, there will be no service here. We're not closing down. Don't be panic. There's a renovation happening in this building. They're going to be fixing it. Maybe we're going to come and see new wow here. Amen. So there will be some things going on here. So we're going to have no service here as from the leadership department. The, the next service is going to be um, effectively on the 21st of April. Amen. Um, we're not having service here, but maybe there'll be some uh, some sort of thing put in place. But it will be announced or we will organize what to do. Even though it might not be here, but there'll be somewhere um, in Jesus' name. That we may meet or some some sort of way to have service. Amen. Um, every Wednesday is Bible study. Amen. Every Wednesday is Bible study. We do rotationally. So we're coming from um, from one of the cities of Melbourne last month uh, in Madingley. And this month we have moved to St. Albans area. Amen. And if you are, <clears throat> if you live in around St. Albans or you live in anywhere around this place, we are meeting at our elders' house. Amen. 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 You know, even the Bible says, if anyone is sick among you, call the elders and they pray for you. So that house is a house of blessing. Amen. Every house is always a house of blessing, but it's special because we are living at, at the elders' house. And guess what? On Sunday, and preaching the word of God, saying something, or even out there, you may have heard something about the Bible or about what people say about Jesus Christ, you are, you are in doubt of. Come. Ask questions. We answer all kinds of questions. Personal life, general, anything that pertains to the Bible. Because there is nothing on earth that is not in the Bible. If, if you're part of that, it's very important. Amen? And uh, every every um, Friday is a prayer meeting. The time for the Bible study is 6.30 to 7.30 p.m. One hour, not two hours, one hour. So if you're going to come, be there on time. So we can be able to finish on time. And prayer meeting is 6.30 to 7.30 p.m. We meet and we pray. Everybody has to pray. We can't pray for you, we pray with you. And you're going to be uh, very prayerful if you don't watch how other people pray. It's very important because sometimes we don't know how to pray. We don't know what to pray for. You know, some, some way of how we structure ourselves in time of prayer, we don't know it personally, but when we come in, we in group and we pray. And you hear people here and you, are, you learn the way in which it's structured by the scripture. Or how the leader of uh, the church is structured in prayer, they can help you to personally pray even when you're not in church. So come and join us to pray. Pray for the church, pray for the ministry, pray for your children, pray for your family, pray for the future of your children. Even when you are not here. Because every word that comes out of your mouth to God is not in vain. God will show the answer. Amen. Amen. And uh, every third Sunday of a month, the Jubilee Sunday will be meet here with Jubilee to dance, we worship. Now the praise and worship team, we are going to be having our effective practices. Now Saturday is the youth meeting. It's currently in um it's in Tani, currently it's in Tani, at Mr. Daniel's house. Amen. We are meeting there. The last Saturday we're gonna be there effectively to be participating. So we're gonna pray another strategy to make it easy for everybody to learn. I believe that uh, when I was not here last Sunday song, so I feel that I thought I, I don't know what it did here, but I know we, we can do better. Let us be serious, brothers and sisters. Let's be serious so that we can do what is right. This job is not for one person. We can't look at what we can do. We can't look at look. We set up each other all the time. We have to learn something. Let us help each other so that we can be able to excel in the kingdom of God. Amen. Amen. And if there's any more announcement, um, it will be emphasized by Pastor later on. Thank you.